And yes, before we start the video, I didn't realise how long this video was actually going to be. So, if you're going to watch the entire video, it's probably best to get a drink and a snack. Probably ten of each. And hope you guys enjoyed the video and please subscribe. Hello everybody, it's your friend Cash Ballam and welcome back to another video. Today we are playing Hogwarts Legacy uh, with a twist because today um, this is going to be the first, well technically the second video I upload with my face on it. So um, yeah, hopefully this will be um, cool. So, um, by the way, this is what I look like. Hi. <coughs> oh my god, sorry. So, we are playing Hogwarts Legacy. As I said. And, um, yeah. I'm also playing this on my Nintendo. You can see I have the controller. So, um, let's start playing. So if the uh, green screen effect isn't perfect, it's kind of new. Claim reward. Merlin's cloak. Legendary uh, cloak in mystical blue and gold. Ooh. <laughs> Owl glasses. Hat. Red hat. Red scarf. Blue jacket. Blue. Slytherin. Slyth... Finally, we are going to start a new game. And if, in case you didn't know, the intro of this game is basically an hour long. Also, I need it. Hogwarts Witchcraft and Wizardry. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted as Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. Term begins on Sorry. Term, be term begins on the 1st of September. Primar uh, pr preliminary supplies have been collected for you and you will accompany and you'll accompany you on your journey to the castle. For you and will on the way to the castle, journey to the way to the castle. As you may be aware, the, dec the decree for the reasonable restriction of underage society prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside school. However, due to your unique circumstances, the Ministry has gradually agreed to allow Professor Eleazar Il Fig Professor F Eles Elizia Fig to help you hone as hone as your spell casting before escorting you from London to the castle f for the start of term feast and the sorting ceremony. Your sincerely, Professor uh, Weasley. Professor Weasley, D deputy headmistress. Start game. <coughs> God, I am hot! Holy moly! That's definitely not me. That does look like me, technically. I'm also not a girl. Wait. Kind of like that one, though. This one's more... <laughs> Keep pressing the wrong button. So this one's m me looking like normal. This one's me in fashion style. So I'll take normal me. Face shape. <coughs> okay, that's not me. Jesus. What are these different... What are these faces? I'm definitely taking the normal one. I 
course I don't want any um actually according to my calculation no I'm not, not gonna do that hairstyles not even like normal kind of want it long like a bit longer at the back yeah that should be good hair colors nice complexion freckles and more want none like that don't really need a scar um eye color i like i like the eye color maybe finalize your character i'm eager to get to hogsmeade it was wonderful i believe i'm really going to enjoy this class <laughs> definitely taking voice one I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. That was quite something. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. <laughs> That's good. It was wonderful. I, a few cobwebs and... That was quite something. Right, I wanted to hear the last one again. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. It was wonderful. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Okay, difficulty. A focus on story with minimal gameplay challenge. A balanced game... A light gameplay challenge. A balanced gameplay challenge. A demanding gameplay challenge. I'm gonna do... Normal. First name, um, oh, um, I need to think of a good name, um, Greg, uh, Greg, um, what about Greg Gregson? Greg Gregson. Yes, that's my name. I'm obviously a wizard. You're a wizard, Harry! You're a wizard! Yeah, that looks like me. It appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite you sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate I you so. working with me before the time begins. Who's that? George <laughs> Osric. George. Glad my oh, rather Professor cryptic Fig. description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatre goers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I best not speak here, Eliazar. Eliazar, that's how you pronounce it. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Well, it might be it is. It's just Ages maybe... Ages since I've been to the castle. Angles. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. There's something not right. What were those called? Um, yeah, there was horses in. Ah, it's probably nothing. 
There were these horses in uh, the Harry Potter series. I can't remember what they were called. Um, but you couldn't see them unless you'd see someone die. Avalanche! One of Rose games. Sports Key Games Wizarding World. Wizardry World. That middle one was the, um... What, what was it called? Or, oh, um, the, um... Crap, I can't remember anything. I it was caught ages ago. Left for Scotland. <laughs> Just barely. <laughs> <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. <gasps> None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen this? Ranrock Goblin I Rebellion. Have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he um, is that's a, a dragon? significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? She wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. <laughs> What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Yeah, there is a glow there. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We did. George! The dragon's um glowing as well. Hey! You can see him now because uh we just witnessed George's death. That's when everyone died at the end. Okay, I'll see you in the next episode. Aww. Squirrel! Are you alright? <coughs> You're hurt. I can see that. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. Wigan World? That stuff will write you in a second. My... Uh Should have probably started with easy mode instead. What happened? Oh, George. Sorry. I can't believe he. <laughs> what the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair? A typical dragon would never. Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. <laughs> but that <laughs> key you discovered was clearly <laughs> a portkey. <laughs> portkey? An item Greg enchanted Rexon. to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. Oh, 
I'm what feeling better, name. sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. L to move. And how do I sprint? This doesn't look like Hogwarts. take us farther from london than the carriage traveled we're somewhere in the scottish highlands sir those ruins do you think the port key was meant to lead us there i do this has not been the day either of us expected but miriam sent that port key to george for a reason and i believe that she and now george died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to if you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. How does it jump off the cliff? Um. Mind your step. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam Wait. spent years searching for evidence God, of, a was a high jump. of ancient magic. Weep! Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Weep! Hogwarts Castle was built by, and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. It says pot. But sir, pot. why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But That's magic is no reason. different than any power. What really what matters is, is the one who wields it. I don't know what it is, but... Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. For Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. ZR. Excellent! Use your camera R to select an active target. Some players prefer to select targets and move the avatar with the same stick. By disabling ca camera relative targe targeting in the settings. Or in settings. But what about this? Like... Boy, wait for me, Mike. Ah! That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Your one works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. I was if I hit oh walk straight through him. Now oh, where do we go? Ah up there. Ah Wait, there was a curse over here. That's probably right. 51 galleons! Well, that, that is a galleon, right? Every single pot needs to be destroyed because of how much pottery. We're close now, it's just ahead. I can see that, and it's also very bright. Wait, got a bright idea. Got a bright idea. Steady yourself! Repair I guess 
worked. Almost there. God, this camera is sensitive. Here. I suspect they valued their privacy. That portkey led us here for a reason. As you've said. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. I found one. This entire castle is out of place. It shouldn't be here. Whoa. Explore the rooms. Professor, this statue... This may have been his home. Enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? It's just a. Uh, it's cool. What's this? <laughs> Professor Fig! Look at him. Yeah! How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Like the goblin. Where are we? I don't believe it. This is a bank, isn't it? There's a goblin. Hello? Greg Gregson. A moment. <laughs> <Ooh. clears throat> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. I told you it was a bank. Vault number twelve, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key. Hmm? Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. Well, that should be teleporting, right? This way. Or on the desert to the location. I should teleport you out, so should Stay close. After you. Yeah, after you. Inside the cart, if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> is there no seat belt? Or is that even required? How many vaults are there in Green Cots? Whoa! Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? 
They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults. Oh, by the way, this is before Harry, Harry Potter. Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. I don't understand all these somersaults or whatever you call them. Why does it spin around so many times? Vault number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. What's that on his arm? On your way. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Well, there is no one going there anymore because it's abandoned. Sure, right? You have arrived at your final destination. Here we are. has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 yes. until today. There's a chest down. No, I didn't get the chest. Thank you for your help. Yeah, I wouldn't go in there. Hey, 49. Keep your eyes open, man. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. There's something Sir, yellow I wonder there. if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Best of luck. <sighs> Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Wow, sure, it think. was definitely unexpected. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. You can Let's see, see it. What we're missing, Just we? look with your eyes. Ready your wand and focus. Steady your uh, wand with L and guide it along the symbol's path to learn the spell. There's a corresponding input when prompted to accelerate your wand's motion along the symbol's path. Okay. Why do I need to accelerate? That's probably why. Yes! I got it! Revelio. There! I saw something! You Move a bit closer and it. try again! A door? Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Isn't Professor. It? That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. <coughs> Have you ever gone into a vault b before? It's very high voltage. Lumos! 
This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to vault. earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. Apparating and disapparating. Isn't that like a... Oh yeah, that's the teleportation um, thing. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Rebellion. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Let's go. Yes. Lumos! You acquire the one Lord Tank Charm Lumos, which has automatically been slotted to your spell set. Lumos creates a light and the tip of your wand is, as you can see in the darkness. Hold Z and R and tap X to uh, cast or extinguish Lumos. Lumos, well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. It's doing something. Oh no. Someone's about to attack me or not. X! Ow! So there comes up a button, right? Oh! This is the same music as in Choo Choo Charles! Copyright! Professor! Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Well, the where light... am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. This way. There it is. That's where they're leading me. That glow again. Oh no, I've got to do this myself, don't I? Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Yeah. Lumos. Seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Oh, 
Oh, I am. Owning. Owning. Hold X during Protego to stun enemies with a stupefied counter-attack. Stun enemies take extra damage inter but indicted with golden numbers. So hold X. Protego. Oh, I can sprint. Ah, it's just normal. It's definitely nothing out of the ordinary. How did you? What is this place? But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. This seems. I wonder. A bit easy. Of course it is. Follow my lead. I wonder how can you breathe in that? Who's that? Maybe impossible to follow. These people are probably very important with the story. You see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful Rookwood. secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes. Percival Rackham. Percival Rackham. The wizard who the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge. And the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. Probably important. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never skip it. 
What's going on with this hair? Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We would it all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. No, run, Rock. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Oh, why lie? Seems why? my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir? Don't they say anything. Have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I, I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. I have no patience for traitors. He did what he was supposed no. to do. Idiots. Where were we? I'm not were... giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. There's something going on with the water. We're going to have to fight this one as well. That was close. Oh. Oh. Recording for about forty minutes. Are you all right? Fine, yes. sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. You're no. Where are we? Keep hitting my microphone. <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket. And the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. What is this? That's a train. Is that Hogwarts? Sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, 
I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? No, my screen turned off. No, it fixed. Who is that? Phineas Nigellus Black. Prepare yourself. Isn't that to serious meet Black? The headmaster. Black's cousin or brother thing. Fig. Cousin nice brother of you thing. To join us. That's a thing. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has. Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. <laughs> I always like the floating candles. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. I always like the sorting hat. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? Yeah. You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Indeed. Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Mm. I wonder... Mmm, I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mmm, what is it? I wonder. A sense of loyalty? I believe myself to be a true friend. I know I value that trait in others. Mmm. You do not give up easily, do you? You are undaunted by challenges that lie ahead. And your loyalty to a friend delayed your arrival here this evening. Perhaps you belong in Hufflepuff. <laughs> nope. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Oh yeah, I'm eager for power. You belong mm. in Slytherin! I look so happy, God. Why did the quality of the picture just drop like a billion? Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. Okay. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I just skipped dinner. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm Professor Weasley. Would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? 
I shall see to it, sir. I didn't say any young people. As I was saying, my first years. I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Keep hitting my microphone. As well, Professor. As deputy headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. Okay. <gasps> It's not uh, common for a student to uh, begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit uh, of a challenge, but uh, one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. Greg Gregson. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Where's sleep anyone? well. <coughs> Milk doesn't taste good. I'll be back with you in two weeks and see if I have salmonella. What is wrong with me? Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. This is nice. But is it common to be in the common room? I suppose some introductions are in order. Did you see the way they just waltzed in at the end of the sorting ceremony last well, night? Well, I suppose... I no. Sebastian Sallow. Can I help you? Ah, oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figgs, who merely joined us for the ride. Still, impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. Professor Fig and I were lucky to escape with our lives. Indeed. And how did you escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. I like Sebastian. We can talk more later. What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough, but not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? Which ones? Seems I may have met a kindred spirit. <laughs> that is a conversation for another time. It was good meeting you. Good luck today. Ominous and Imelda? Eh, uh, might want to think that again. <clears throat> Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. I like... Checkmate. Told you. Oh. I like how wizard chest moves and then does you these, have like... Ah, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills on a broom are legendary. Perhaps Professor Fig's friend would have survived if we'd had your help. Precisely. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. 
There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Goodbye, Amelda. Nice meeting I also you. like how the options don't actually say the same thing as um, they say. I I think I heard one. Hmm. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you you're must new be blind. Fifthly. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. I'd much rather have arrived on time and without a dragon attack en route. I'm sure. How horrible. I can only imagine. Well, it's good to have you in Slytherin. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here. Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status, a pure blood maniac. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes. But I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Nice. 